highest number of new unemployment claims since August. This week, 898,000 Americans filed for unemployment for the very first time. Experts say this indicates the labor market is having a hard time rebounding to pre-coronavirus levels. Here on Texas Today, we are committed to keeping Central Texans working during this pandemic. Every Friday, we feature a local business that would love your support. Texas Today's Maria Aguilera shares the story of an owner of two local businesses. Good morning, Maria. Good morning to you. We all know it's hard enough owning one business. Now imagine owning two during a pandemic and seeing different results from each. Two businesses side by side in Waco with the same owner have had different experiences during the pandemic. Leslie Ingledow and her husband own La Bella Salon and Beauty Lounge as well as Smarty Pants Resale Shop and both had a rough start when they reopened after the shutdown. It was scary and we did it and we didn't make very much money but it was just stepping stone to where we are now. Ingledow, a mother of five, says they opened Smarty Pants to help Waco families meet their needs. It's a place where they can buy gently used kids' clothing at a low cost. She says she realizes the importance of the shop during a time where many people are on a budget. And as far as business, they're doing much better. So the first two weeks were very difficult, but then now it's almost back. And I, I cannot complain. I was scared to death. However, things haven't been quite as good at the salon. The pandemic hit. It hit LaBella very hard, much harder. They were reaching record sales prior to COVID-19, but after shutting down for a few months, things aren't the same. Our customers are still very scared and um, haven't returned. A lot have returned, but 50 percent. Ingledow says it's been difficult, especially since you can't be socially distant while receiving their services. All she's hoping for now is for both businesses to be back to where they were before the pandemic. I felt confident in our business. I didn't worry about it at all. And we have the best employees, I mean, and the best shoppers. So um, I felt great about it. And now it's scary building it back up. Mm -hmm. For more on these two businesses and others, you can visit KCNTV.com. Maria Aguilera, 6 News, back to you. And if you're a business owner or know someone who would like to be featured, we'd love to hear from you. You can email news at KCNTV.com or text 254-859-5481.